President Obama has praised Dallas police at a memorial service for five officers shot dead last week in the deadliest day for U.S. law enforcement in almost 15 years. The five officers were gunned down by a man expressing anger over recent police killings of black people. The president told his audience that police do an incredibly hard and dangerous job fairly and professionally, adding that officers deserve respect and not scorn, and he cited their actions during the Dallas shooting as an example. I'm here to insist that we are not as divided as we seem. And I know that because I know America. When the bullets started flying, the men and women of the Dallas police, they did not flinch and they did not react recklessly. They showed incredible restraint. Helped in some cases by protesters, they evacuated the engine isolated the shooter, saved more lives than we will ever know. The president, who was due to meet the families of the police victims, also addressed the wider problems of America's race relations. The murders happened at a protest over police violence against black victims. He drew parallels between Dallas and the racist shooting of nine black people inside a South Carolina church last year. And he reiterated a call for stricter gun control in the U.S., an appeal, as ever, likely to fall on deaf ears in Congress.